Hi guys, welcome to Love is Turning Up. Today we're going to be reading Caillou Waits for Santa. It was, a, it was the day before Christmas. Caillou's house was filled with the sweet smell of freshly baked cookies. Lights sparkled on the Christmas tree and presents were piled underneath. Caillou could hardly wait to open them. While they waited for Santa Claus to come, Caillou and Rosie watched Gilbert play with the ribbons on the gifts. Caillou asked his sister, do you know who put those presents under the tree? Rosie thought for a moment. Mommy and Daddy! Do you know who else brings us presents? He continued. Santa Claus, Rosie answered. Yes, Caillou exclaimed. He's coming tonight! Caillou and Rosie were so excited they jumped up and down. Mommy and Daddy came into the living room. Daddy laughed. It looks like you two are ready for Christmas. Caillou could hardly stay still. When can we open our presents? Tomorrow morning, when it's Christmas Day, Daddy said. You have to wait until Santa Claus has been here. When is he coming? So Caillou asked. He'll come after dark, when you're sound asleep, Daddy said. Caillou had an idea. He went to the window and closed the curtain. There, it's dark. Santa Claus can come right now. It has to be nighttime, Mommy explained. Daddy opened the curtains. The moon is coming up. It will be nighttime soon. The car didn't think that night was coming fast enough. Later in the evening, evening Caillou made a snack for Santa Claus. Yummy, milk and cookies, Daddy says. No, Daddy, this is for Santa Claus. Caillou also took some carrots out of the refrigerator. Carrots for Santa Claus? Mommy asked him. Caillou laughed. No, Mommy, they're for the reindeer. At last, it was nighttime. Caillou got into bed as fast as he could. I'm going to stay awake all night so I can see Santa. Santa only comes when children are asleep, Mommy said. Daddy and Mommy kissed Caillou and said goodnight and closed his bedroom door. But Caillou was determined to wait for Santa Claus. As Caillou lay quietly in the dark. He listened for the sounds of Santa and his reindeer. He wondered why Santa didn't come more quickly. Then Caillou realized that Santa had to take gifts to all the children in the world. Maybe Santa needs a helper, Caillou thought. Caillou imagined that he was helping Santa deliver the gifts. It's snowing hard tonight, Santa said. Can you see Jonathan's house, Caillou? Look, Santa, it's right over there. I'm so glad you're helping me, Caillou. I, can do, I couldn't do all this without you. Caillou thought he'd make very good helper. Caillou was having trouble staying awake. It was so cozy under the covers. He closed his eyes just for a minute. And when Caillou opened his eyes, the sun had come up. It was Christmas morning. Caillou hurried to look at his Christmas stocking. It was filled with presents. Caillou ran into his parents' bedroom. Mommy, Daddy, Santa came. I guess Santa Claus really does visit children while they are sleeping, Mommy said with a laugh. Ding dong, the doorbell rang. It's Grandma and Grandpa, Caillou shouted. Now we can finally open our presents. Merry Christmas! Thank you for listening, and please be sure to watch my other videos, and like and subscribe. Bye!